Hello and welcome back. We are gonna talk to Jennifer after, after destroying so many Terminators and majorly screwing over Skynet. Police. Yeah, can I? No. They moved the trade box. Maybe it's still inside. Oh, actually the game shows who we can talk to. That's kind of cool. Don't they just no, have no idea? Just run around like I do. Oh, thank God, you're finally here. How did it go? Did you find the soldiers? I did. I helped them escape from that hospital. You don't give up on your people, do you? I like that. So what now? They're supposed to come for me soon. Great. That means that you're going home? No more scavengers constantly nagging you to do things for them? I bet you like the sound of that. Oh, Erin's still up too. Go talk to her. She won't admit it, but she was just as worried as I was. Yennefer's story. Do you need help with anything? I I I I'm pretty sure I, I I'm just going with the story that I'm I'm a terminator trying to blend in. That's what makes sense to me. It actually makes more sense that I'm a resistance soldier. <laughs> so that wouldn't be even be a twist. That just makes sense. Do you need help with anything? Do you need help with anything? <laughs> Is that your best pickup line? What? Sorry, that was a bad joke. I I tend to do that when I'm stressed. I think I got it from my dad. Better that than his mustache, right? <clears throat> oh, I'm sorry. Don't mind me. That would be cool. Hey, do you want me to pick up, pick you up? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Fuck. That didn't really work. Okay, it seems like you were very close. What was he like? What? I'm just gonna gloss over that? Come on! Screw her dad! Let's talk about the... Let's talk about the pickup lines. Here. I don't know. I don't have any. Whatever. <laughs> seems like you were very close. Seems you were very close. As close as could be. He taught me everything I know. Sometimes without me even knowing. This one time, when I was little, he wanted to make a huge sign that said, Welcome, on the side of our house in Pasadena. What? So he said, I bet you can't spell that. <laughs> and of course I had to prove him wrong. Believe me, now I know how stupid that was. That wasn't stupid. Not at all, that was very clever. Not at all. That was very clever. Yeah. He was always full of bright ideas. Thanks for trying to make me feel better. After Judgment Day, my dad turned our house into a safe haven. A home for everyone who lost theirs. We were like a family with an endless supply of uncles and aunts. I guess my father wanted to help with the war. We never really used guns. So the only thing we could do was to help others in need. Oh my god. What's with the second lines? You won't like long enough to make a difference if you can't protect yourself. I mean, yeah, I mean, seems like he helped a lot of people. I would say you, uh, like, you and your dad helped a lot of people. No? Seems like he helped a lot of people. He did. Right till the very end. Anyway, it was actually really cool. Everybody loved him, and he loved having them around. I think it's because he always had a brand new audience to listen to his bad jokes. He had this really terrible one. He'd walk into the room and ask if anyone had seen his remote because his team was playing. <laughs> they always laughed at it. I'll never understand why. Was he a sports fan? I don't... I don't think the voice protagonist was a great choice for the game, but we might see... Uh... A's might see it utilized in the future you know we might see some you know cutscene with him or whatever where you know we can voice protagonist are is kind of like a, a mandatory um yeah i mean was he a sports fan was he a sports fan i don't think so he had a jersey that he wouldn't let anyone touch but i don't think it was a token of his love of sports more like a reminder of simpler times Look at me yapping. 
I'm sorry, you probably have enough on your plate. Anyway, thanks. It's really nice to have someone to talk to. Jennifer appreciated that. No smoking. Okay, I won't do that. So, I bought, brought a lot of stuff. You guys can uh, have some plasma or 95s. I'm gonna keep one. Just in case. It seems like the the scrap reset here. Uh, Lockpick we're gonna need. We might as well sell all of these and we can just consider uh, buying them if we wanna just uh, do something. Because selling is basically just uh, not, not exactly selling in this game. Uh, we can buy that but it doesn't matter too much. Oh, that's... Okay, plasma ammo. So this is all useful. We also got a bunch of chips. But how the fuck could I use these chips? Okay, except transition. Uh, and... Uh, how do you use this? Is it at the crafting bench? No. That's not how I do it. Red plasma cells. Okay, that's for better rifles. Oh, we can craft this. Only 15 bullets, though. Sound decoy! I don't care too much about that. Explosives, chemicals, and metal scraps. Hey, so, so, explosives, oh yeah, buy all of these, and these, and these, just buy everything always. Now, metal scraps, chemicals, seems like chemicals is the limiting factor here, we can just go 12 chemicals, uh, 12 bombs and uh, 12 metal scraps, something like that, oh yeah, accept transaction, uh, craft these pipe bombs, all of them, because I like the pipe bombs, uh, what else can I do, we can go some, okay, first, what else do we need? Because I got some pipe bombs now. I got red plasma cells. I, I have some, you know, we could use some small caliber ammo. But it's not like, a, not really needed, you know. I have some shotgun shells. So what what would keep, what could we really use here? I don't know. What I have extra of. I have a lot of electronic parts. And fabrics and energy cells. So, how does that work? Metal scraps, electronic part, and energy cells. Metal scraps, electronic parts, and energy cells. So, I can get. Uh, not, not that, just this. Just some easy crafting. We get some extra bullets when we actually get access. To um, plasma rifles. Okay, that should be good enough. Uh, Aaron, let's talk. No need to worry, I'm fine. Who said I was worried? I've been thinking a lot about it, and if I can, I've decided to join the Resistance. I'll do more good there than here. I'm glad to hear that. I just hope you're better supplied over there than we are. Speaking of which, I see you've got those antibiotics I asked for. Good. Now I can call Ryan off. I asked him if he brought a shovel with him. 
If you think that was too morbid, he said that after Judgment Day, digging graves was one of the few things he actually got better at. Cool. <laughs> Go to sleep. God damn it, Aaron. I'm not some child. You can't just tell me to go to sleep. I'm tired and I'm, I kind of want to go to sleep, but you can't just tell me to go to sleep, okay? We can go weapons too, but that's not a priority. Science. Okay, we can go hacking too. Oh yeah, this allows us to hack medium terminal, so we actually need this. Survival. Uh, I don't know if this actually helps me. Look at this damage decrease by 50%. That's insane. So this is really good. Like, damage decreased by 10%. That's not too big of a deal. But, like, damage decreased by 50%. That means I have double health. That's insane. Okay, let's just go hacking too. We're gonna need that. Alright, I'm going to sleep. Uh, I, I would like some privacy, you know. But I guess that's... Uh, <clears throat> That's optional around here. A few days later. Wow, I was really sleepy. Jacob, come upstairs. There's someone here to see you. I'm coming. Oh, can we talk to her? Food for thought. The world before Judgment Day was much different than I imagined. Jennifer's teaching me math with some with whatever she can find lying around, like metal scraps and chemical parts. Matt with that. Okay. But I found an old book, and it looks like the people in the past used food to learn math. It said this guy, Mike, wanted to buy 30 watermelons. Never seen a watermelon in my life, but it looks real good. Anyhow, he only had money for 28 of them. And this is a pretty good... Oh my god. But but that that's still a lot. Uh, there was also this girl, I forgot her name, and she had like... 10 chocolate bars and I ate 4 of them and she still has 6 chocolate bars left for later can you imagine having all that food math problems from the past make me hungry <laughs> that's actually a very interesting take on that it just seemed dumb but like the the, the last line uh, good luck out there made it interesting Laura just has nothing to say Unfortunate. She could have just died. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm not saving you. You're too boring. Oh! Resistance Soldier. JDO RS26457. At your service. Definitely don't sound like a Terminator. Hey, can I talk to you? Private Rivers. Yes, sir. I've got a message from South Division's Field Commander Baron. She's agreed to meet with you. She set up a rendezvous point at the unfinished metro station. You'll need to enter the canal system under the bridge. The meeting's supposed to take place tomorrow, so I suggest moving out soon. Understood. And, Rivers, because of what you did for our guys at that hospital, I'll give you a heads up about Commander Baron. Don't expect a warm welcome. What? Looks like you're leaving us soon. Aaron wants to join me. What about you? What do you think about enlisting? Me? <laughs> no. I still have hope I'll get that bus running again. Also, I don't like the attention Skynet's given you guys. I'd rather stay as far from the line of fire as possible. Patrick, get back here! You better go see what's going on. I don't know. I can't believe I'm still a fucking private. I saved all those guys. You hear me? Fucking he's gone. Even for an infiltrator machine, you guys should bump me in rank. At least captain. Alright. Hey. I'm totally on board with you saying that, you know, we should just head out on our ourselves and just make, make a life, you know? That would that would sound probably more like me than trying to uh, just uh, I don't know sign up with the resistance. Don't get me wrong, fuck machines, I guess. But you know, I mean, I don't know. 
Oh, I don't want to fight. I, I kind of want to fight. I, I do want to fight, but, you know, I, I don't trust the resistance at all. Is everything all right? Patrick's decided that he wants to be a scavenger. And now he won't come out, even though I'm worried sick he'll get stuck. Get back here right now, Patrick! But there's lots of cool stuff in here. You told me it's our job to find stuff for the group. Mm. That's tough. Because I can tell him that he should listen to her sister, but I think at the moment her sister, I mean, his sister is being overprotective. And, and it doesn't seem like there's an immediate danger. And uh, she might... I know, I know this is very tough to say, but she might need to, you know, just, like, let him have this. Also, this could be a little bit crushing. A little bit of, like, a, a sand of, like, just a bit of point of, like, you know, this is, this is just something he can do, you know? He should feel good about it. I think, I think, just see what's, what's in there. Uh, Patrick, what do you see? Maybe there's something valuable there. I think I see something. Wait, I'll go deeper. No! Get back here right now! Jeez, Jacob! Patrick! I'm alright. I'm alright. I've got something. Oh, you Check out this book I found! Good job, Patrick. It's a military training manual. Thanks a lot, Rivers. What was that all about just now? I've got a meeting with Commander Baron. I'm leaving soon. Okay. I'm going with you. And don't even try to stop me. Are you sure? What's the matter? Don't they let you boys bring dates? Wow. Okay, new skill point. Cool. I, I wish I had... Uh... Don't worry, kid. She's just worried about you. I wish... She never lets me do anything. Yeah. That's what older siblings do. They look out for us. Was your brother like that, too? Well, not really. I just I just want him to feel competent, you know? Not scared, necessarily. You know? If he's, if he's just afraid of, a, like, a, a hole under a safe camp, then it's, it's not gonna be great. I wish I could tell her that. I didn't... You know, I, I know it feels like I went against her authority, and that's kind of what I did. But, and what I would have liked to do is, you know, maybe tell her that. So, maybe I'm not gonna be the one who encouraged Jacob, but she can do it. But this is just my, my thought on that, you know. Okay, now we have some extra points. I can go weapons too. I'm at level 10. And we're gonna go level uh, 3 weapons to deal with Terminators. Explosives are really good. But also, not dying is pretty good too. <laughs> Although, this is only really worth it if we uh, commit to it. Pick up disarmed enemy laser traps. Okay. Permanently disable disarm enemy laser traps. Disarm any enemy laser traps for six seconds. Okay. If I hit it with an explosive. I don't know. I kind of want to go... Well, we definitely need to go to weapons free. That's for sure. Weapon upgrades are more effective, but how the fuck do we upgrade weapons? God damn it. Game, I don't know that. I can't just like draw it. Is it is it just for plasma weapons? I can't put this in. My weapon skill is too low. God damn it. Okay. I like explosives. This is good. I don't really pr want to prioritize crafting anymore. And I definitely want weapons. So I want to go with weapons free. 
and that will allow me one extra point, which we can put in... I don't fucking know. Maybe explosives? I'm not doing stealth. Oh, temporarily mark enemies with weapon aim. Move 20% faster while crouching. That just doesn't matter to me. So I think we're just gonna go weapons too. That's also gonna be very effective. 50% more damage with weapons. Upgrades are a little more effective and we can use plasma weapons. So it's, it says upgrades are more effective. So by level 12, kind of, we should be able to get some upgrades, right? Also, I think at level 12, I might might even need to go into a fast learner free. <laughs> Just to go with the max XP style. I'm good. Yeah, the first, let's go. Uh, yeah, you're just yeah, you're just coming with me. So you basically just decided that you're my girlfriend, right? And that that's that's a interesting way to flirt, I guess. Hey, I'm your girlfriend. That's it. It's like okay, cool. Ah, <laughs> uh, sure. But I I have no way to react to that. <laughs> Looks like on? we got here first. Is everything all right? You seem a little out of it. <sighs> Sorry. I probably shouldn't zone out like that with a gun in my hands, huh? Am I making you nervous? Not really. <laughs> no, not really. Well, you should be. I don't have any formal training like you. I never even held a gun until... Recently. Can I be honest with you? Sure. There's a reason I decided to come here with you. I want to meet Commander Baron myself. The They're fuck? here. Oh my when God. I heard that Private Rivers of the non-existent Pacific Division wants, no, needs to have a meeting with me, I thought, oh, what a lucky girl I am. But then I started thinking, who is Private Rivers? And why should I treat him as anything other than the deserter he is? So right now I'm hoping you give me a good reason why I shouldn't just skip the court-martial and execute you where you stand. This is bullshit. And who do we have here? A brave scavenger? Rivers, do you always bring unauthorized civilians to fight your battles for you? We would have got to you sooner if you hadn't pulled out all your troops from Pasadena. People died there because of you! And what did you do about it? Did you pick up a gun and fight back? Or did you run like you sewer rats always do? Yeah, I don't like the resistance. Hey, listen here, Laurel Bailey. Uh... God damn it. Also, I kind of suspected... Uh, Jennifer, that maybe she wants to kill Laura Bailey here, uh, because uh, because like like she really wanted to meet with the Baron. Jennifer is right. Uh, there is no need for that. Stay out of it. No, no, no. Yeah, yeah. She's right. I'm not gonna shut her up. Jennifer's right. There's no need for any of that. Yeah. Today is all about private rivers. So what can you tell me that I don't know already? A few weeks ago, the outpost I was stationed at was ambushed by a Terminator, I think. It was half man, half machine. The entire Pacific Division was wiped out by a single enemy. Half man, half machine? What are you talking about? How did your men let an enemy get that close to you? And we didn't know it was a machine. It could walk, talk, bleed, sweat. There was no way to distinguish it as an enemy. It infiltrated us perfectly. This infiltrator... Is it still alive? I I'm not sure. Uh, it's me. Okay, for now keep everything to yourself. I don't <laughs> want any rumors. Especially since you only think you saw something. <gasps> Skynet's coming! We're not done here yet, Rivers. Take this plasma! You're a resistance soldier. Time to act like one. To your positions! Oh shit. Oh shit! Drones! Up there! Wait, what? Fire at will! What is this? What is this rifle that I'm holding? 
Oh, I'm holding a plasma rifle TC 2000 R. Wait, what? I can. Oh shit! This has upgrade slots. Kill them all! I'm not gonna use my plasma rifle for this. I'm master at taking out all these Good suckers. Cover. Don't be shy, Rivers. This is a great time to impress me. I think I got one. Nah, that was all me. You guys even did some damage. Okay, that's all me. More will come. We need to move. Uh, no, no, no. That's not how we. Not that's not how we do things around here. Jesus Christ, people! How about looting? Fucking hell! Fucking amateurs! Wait, what is this? What if this is we're gonna loot it? Get that door open! What the fuck? Fall back! Fall back! Eyes on that door! Terminators! Oh shit. Well, I'm gonna need some. Oh, this is a semi-auto weapon. Can I upgrade it? Die. I guess this is. So clear. Oh, oh no, what the hell? Aerial, go, go, go! Oh, shit! I'm running. Got detected. We need to heal. Can I take out the aerial? You have left your party? What the fuck, game? You stupid! They left me! And I had to heal. They ye they yelled loudly. Fuck Rivers! Oh my god. They ran away. Take cover! Don't be shy, Rivers! This is a great time to impress me! What? Now what happened? I I've been terminated. Okay, fine. God damn it, guys. Okay, let's hide. Take cover! Scout Don't girl. be shy, Rivers. Some of them are this armored. is a great time to impress me. I think I got one! No, nope. I'm still getting all of them. They probably did that dick move just to More will try come. to get some we skills here, but it didn't work. Get that door open! Just, just loot stuff. What the fuck? Fall back! Fall back! Eyes on that door! Terminators! What if I Okay, I can jump into the inventory. And I don't know if this... Yeah, we might be able to upgrade this. It has 65 damage. Oh. Okay. 65 with a single shot? That's pretty good. So, do we have some upgrades here? I can put in this. No? What the fuck? How does it work? I can't put it in. How does it work? Wait, what? It worked? No, that, that didn't work. How does it work? Oh, remove from slot? No. How do you put the fucking upgrades in? <laughs> I don't get it. No. I mean, what makes sense is that we just pull it over it? But it doesn't work? I don't know. Still not time to use those chips. Oh shit. They do a lot of damage. So you guys better not oh my god. Oh no it's not. Ariel, go, go, go! I don't have time! Please wait for me! I hate all of you! I hate all of you! Oh, fuck. I can loot the terminators. Shit, we gotta hide. Up there, on that balcony. 
see. Take headshot damage. What the fuck are you doing, mate? Neutralized. Shoot those gas canisters. I'm trying to not kill my teammate. You with that AK. Take care of them. But it's uh, it. kind of tricky. All right. It's not gonna work. Shit. One damn one hit, and I'm almost dead. Through that balcony. Okay. But it Come does on, encourage me to play in cover. Well, you're a scavenger. But these assholes. Find some. Probably. Gonna leave me behind. I don't have a lot of time. Let's go. Let's you can go. be sure there's gonna be more. Okay. Let's reload my shotgun. And just use the M16. Armored for spider now. ahead! Don't let it get near you! Oh, shit, we gotta More hide. More terminators! How many? I count three! Okay, this is not a good spot. One left! More incoming! He's taking a, a very wide angle. God. Where can I take cover? Okay, at least we can deal with Terminators. Wow. This is what the resistance is doing all the time. These fucking wooden boxes wouldn't save you against plasma weapons. I wouldn't even save you against pistols. Shit. I really hope that's just a distracting one. Yeah, it is. These spiders don't really like the shotguns. Don't Almost rush there! Jesus Christ, people. What you guys Got grenades? Miss? Fucking throw them! Not I got left behind once. Actually, the corpses disappeared. I don't like... Oh, shit. I don't like that. I need to heal. So basically, I have to kill everything. And they rush Die forward. Already. That. The hard part is done. What? Did I explode myself? Don't rush. Oh, for fuck's sake, I'm gonna die. All these assholes are taking all the covers. Okay, skills. So we can go with a little bit extra explosives, and what else we could use? I could use toughness. Not dying sounds great. Level 12, we're gonna have... Yeah, we're gonna need a lot. I don't know. One toughness? I thing is, currently we're kind of dying from like two or three hits. So, if that doesn't really make it like one more hit, then it doesn't really matter. Toughness is, doesn't have seems pretty good. But explosives. More damage using rockets. Weapon upgrades are more effective. So this is optional. 
Okay. Use Skynet's second generation plasma weapons, violet. Use uh, Skynet's first generation plasma weapons, red. So we only, we kind of need access to that. We, but we don't need access to that. That can wait a little bit. So we can go with a little bit more explosive damage. Yeah, grenades and explosives. Like, explosives are pretty damn good. I think we're just gonna go with that. 10% damage resistance is pointless. First time they did something. Follow me and keep your heads down. I'm getting us out of this. Jesus Christ, they really hate loot. And by the time I get there, the enemies kind of disappear. We don't have time for anything other than auto loot. Oh my God, let me go. I can't go. I don't have time to look around. Because, oh no, you lost the game. That's kind of dumb. Oh shit, what the fuck? Uh oh. I I'm here, guys. This was an ambush. They knew we were coming. How did they know? With the annihilation line getting closer, they must have eavesdropped on our conversation. Oh no way. We're on their radar now. Eavesdropped, right? Oh God shit. God damn it, they were waiting for us. You gotta reload. We're surrounded. Take positions. I got this! Leaving already? There's too many of them! Hold it! Through here! Come on! Follow her! You idiots! We're getting shot in the back! I'm not like you guys! I don't have a lot of faith in, like, running past enemies. Oh shit, another one. Wow. Wait for me, guys! Oh, man. I kill everything they rush Watch forward. Watch out! No! Ah! What? No, we gotta give me a cover. We need to help him. Who? He's dead. You want to help someone? Can I loot him? Help yourself and take his rifle. Can I take his rifle? No. Someone else would have did it. More of them up here. Stay oh, low. Shit. Don't stop shooting. Oh no no no! Are you kidding me? We gotta hide. Oh. Weapon ineffective against the HP aerial. Oh fuck. Nice work. Oh. He managed to knock down the Terminator, but I don't think it kills it. Uh, it doesn't hurt the Terminator. I do like that uh, the enemies are immune area. to some uh, type inside, of attacks. Get inside. That's, that's very cool. It's very uncommon these days as well. Everything just works on everybody. Come on. Oh shit. There's a flyer on top of me. Wait. I see like a, an ammo drop. Oh fuck. No! Oh no! Oh my god, I'm dumb. Restore. That, that better be not too far away. Game. Okay, that's not too far away. More of them up here! Stay low! Don't stop and, uh, shooting! We can't shoot the flyer. Oh fuck. Moment I, that storage area. I kill those. Inside, get inside. Everybody runs away. I don't think we have time. I don't have time. I don't have time. I don't have time. We, we got to run. But we were spread out too thin and had to pull everyone back. When the annihilation line hit run. us, we couldn't hold our positions. We would be. I thought I like to play the game. Is that what happened in Pasadena? Exactly. 
kept. There's a shortcut so that'll get running. us out of here. We just have to make our way to that industrial building. As soon as that aerial moves, we run. What happened? Oh. It's clear. Go. Is it though? Feels like We're we have an FPS close. drop here. Oh shit. I cannot go more than one there. No, I'm not looting. Also, probably I can't loot him. What? Run! This is not a strategy. Oh man. <gasps> Wait, what? Jacob! I really hope I'm not gonna die. Rivers! Are you okay? Shoot that thing! Oh crap! Shoot it! Jacob, get up! I'm getting up. Oh fuck, what? I'm totally gonna die. I need to hide. Well, you guys took them out? Nice work! That means free for you and uh... I don't know. Like 50 billion for me. Sounds about right. We'll cover you! Get out of there! How do they get up? Oh fuck, I see. Oh shit, there's a terminator there. Your definition of cover and my definition of cover might be different, you know. It's okay, you know, common mistake. Not a problem. But, to be fair, that's like a Terminator who doesn't care too much. We'll cover you! Get out of there! Oh, medkits. I should just go back. Oh, we're done. Run! I can't run. We gotta progress slowly here. It's a lot better if you, I don't get shot. In all those movies of like people running, running, uh, trying to outrun bullets, it doesn't fucking work. Just because you're running, running people are basically as easy to hit as, as those people who are standing in place. Even if even they are zigzagging, that's a little bit difficult. But come on. What the fuck is going on here? How do I how do they get up? Oh. Can I just climb up? I don't I don't think that's how I meant to do it. I'm just meant to take the low ground. Thank God you're okay! Save that for later. We're not safe yet. We Just need to get the hell out of here. Come Where on. to? The shelter! Oh shit. And in this scenario, it's better if you spread out so we don't all get murdered together. But maybe the, the copter has to decide one person to shoot and only one person dies. Maybe. Hopefully. Definitely not foolproof. <laughs> the resistance shelter. So obviously I'm trying to work my way up the resistance to kill the big big bosses. Like obviously I just killing Laura is pointless. She's obviously clueless and, and just terrible. Terrible. And that's why I didn't want to do, uh, join Resistance, because look at Laura's leadership. Everybody died but her. And that's just like one get-together for uh, one recruit. I'm sorry about before. And I'm sorry about your soldiers. No need for that. 
You'll have a hard time getting up every morning if you dwell on that too much. Machines don't do that, and if we want to destroy them, neither can we. Sounds like a bad idea. Rivers, since Pacific Division no longer exists, you will now answer to me. That makes you a part of Techcom. Congratulations. No more sitting around waiting for Skynet to come to you. Over here we go out there and meet the enemy face on. This is it. Resistance Shelter, South Division. I feel like I just put a follow comment on you. Baron, DN38217. Commander. There with me. Nice little buggy. Can I get that? Where are the others? Where's my husband? They're dead. Holy shit. <laughs> Over here is our quartermaster. If you need anything beyond the standard issue equipment, work it out with him. Very subtle. And here's Alvin, residing chief Egghead. Uh, I prefer laboratory director. Like I said, Egghead. He supplies all techcom units with weapon modifications. Everything looks well organized. It is. Everyone pulls their weight here. If someone doesn't, we become weak. And you can probably imagine where I stand on being weak. I'll get right to it. There's a reason I decided to meet you. We intercepted some interesting data. It turns out you're part of a prestigious group. A group of people that Skynet marked for termination. See, John Connor, the leader of the Resistance, is number one on that list. Then, there's me. I know, I'm flattered. Every day, we lead, we fight, and we plan on how to destroy Skynet's central core. So I know exactly why we're on that fucking list. But why would Private Rivers be number three? That infiltrator said something about me being marked for termination. Huh. Interesting. I'll have to have a word with Connor about that. And that brings me to my second point, your first assignment. After the Annihilation Line got to Pasadena, Skynet started building installations there. I want you to go there and collect some intel, so we know what we're up against. Sounds dangerous. It will be. Check with Alvin before you go, he'll have something for you. Remember, you might be valuable to Skynet, but the way I see it, you're still a private. Dismissed. That's just a stupid way to do it. So you don't know and my rivers. value. Civilians don't need to know about what happened out there. I'm not some expendable... Like that That's what I was... That's what I feared. That I come here, and I'm just gonna be some ex expendable dude, and I, I, I saw how you deal with your soldiers. I'm not saying, you know, this is gonna be clean and without losses. Obviously not. But... You can't just like... Get people killed non-stop. Do I just fast learner? Oh my god. That does allow me to go up in ranks sooner, but maybe not soon. I, I'm just gonna do it. It's gonna set me back a little bit. So I basically spent three skill points on fast learner. I could have just spent it on something useful like three toughness. Well, that would certainly help. But maybe, maybe it's gonna pay off later. And it's super likely. Because look at this. I spent three skill points on Fast Learner. And in order for this to really pay off, <laughs> that 10%, I would need to have more than 30 skill points, kinda. But mainly Fast Learner enables me to reach the higher levels quicker. So that I guess that's the big advantage. But do I even have enough perks to justify it? If we're just looking at it's just straight up numbers, we have uh, 8 perks, we got uh, 19 perks, and we got... Uh, Thirty-six? So 30, maybe, maybe, it, it's, it's damn close, if you can just get everything, and I don't want to get everything, for example, stealth, you know, I don't really care that, that much about that, but whatever, whatever. I might just get that later. Okay, so weapon mod, the plasma rifle, TC2000. 
I'm not sure about the damage of this. This deals 75 damage and this deals 65 damage. Isn't this... Oh, I got an extra one. That's fine. That's fine. But before we explore the resistance shelter, we're just gonna take a break. And uh, next time, we're just gonna see what's up. I, by the way, I'm loving this. Pretty good stuff. Baron. What are you looking at? My canister? Hmm? Hmm? The couch? You want, you want me to sit on the couch? I don't know. She's looking at something else. Something like that? The candles, maybe. Unclear. Maybe she's just zoning out. Oh shit! I'm stuck! I'm stuck in the couch! What the fuck? Really? God damn it, game! Fucking hell! <laughs> Almost uh, fucking the end of the playthrough right there. Anyway, guys, uh, thanks for watching. See you next time.